Hello everyone, I'm Bruffy1322 and this video serves as an update to the fastest sports classics video where I show the best fully upgraded sports classics cars in terms of lap time. For all the information you need about the series, check that original sports classics video, but otherwise let's see where the new POT custom falls into that list. And it's you know it it's not great and but as is the case with most of the vehicles in this DLC, or it seems like it's been a, a common thing for the vehicles in this DLC, it's a significant improvement on the vehicle that it is based on. So obviously the POT Custom, you gain it by taking a regular POT into Benny's and upgrading it. There's been a lot of vehicles like that throughout this DLC that have been you know, improved or made different versions of the original vehicle. And the POT Custom is following that trend of being quicker than the original vehicle. You know, it's much quicker than the regular POT but it's not anything special in terms of the Sport Classics class as a whole. You're not going to be winning races in this. It falls into 27th place with a 1 minute 16 lap time, and you get 1 minute 4 lap times from the very top vehicles in the Sport Classics class. If you do want to see those very top vehicles in the Sport Classics class, you can always go to the playlist, which is linked down below in the description and the pinned comment, and you can check out all the most up-to-date videos for all the classes in the game. It's all organised at the top of that playlist for both lap time and top speed, the two playlists that we've got, and uh, you you'll be able to just see Sports Classics, followed up by the POD Custom video, then you know Muscle Cars, all that kind of stuff. It it's all in those playlists. We will also see the top speed for the POT Custom later today, but basically, the POT Custom it takes it takes the regular POT and just adds a bigger engine to it. Essentially, it adds more engine power, which it, it makes it quicker. Obviously, as you're seeing from the comparison, than the regular POT, but they don't really improve on the car anywhere else. So it's still got the same braking ability and the same cornering ability. And that means that, you know, it, it can't get around the corners as well as some of the top spot classics. And you're essentially just driving a, a regular POT that's just being given a bit of an engine power boost. So it's an interesting car to drive for that reason, but it's obviously not going to be doing anything in comparison to the top vehicles in the class. Just to point out that the Manana, which is in the Sport Classics class, did also get a Benny's upgrade, and you can get the Manana Custom now, but the Manana Custom is in the Muscle Cars class, so we'll be seeing that with the Muscle Cars 2020 video instead, uh, and it's probably going to be exactly the same sort of story, that it's going to be quicker than the regular Manana, which is pretty slow, but not as quick as the top cars. Not quite sure why Rockstar did that and made the Manana Custom be in Muscle, but hey again this is rockstar we're talking about so that's pretty much it for this one consider supporting on patreon i'll become a youtube member if you want to get testing results early and remember to read the description for more info come up with your thoughts like the video if you enjoyed or found it helpful and subscribe for more thank you all so much for watching i really do appreciate it and i'll see you next time